So over at this morning, we have a lot going on there as the staff are speaking out against Holly Willoughby. Hey guys, it's Marag Marali. Hope you guys are all doing well today. Back at again with another video. If you have not subscribed, click that button, guys. I would appreciate it. It is daily and consistent content. And let's get straight into this video because we seem to have a lot going on still when it comes to Holly. Yeah. So it does look like this morning staff are speaking out against Holly Willoughby and are saying that they are breathing a sigh of relief knowing that she no longer is going to be on the show. Now that is a big statement to make. It clearly shows that this profound impact that you may have had probably did not happen. You've been there for nearly 15, 10 years or so, yet when you leave, the staff, the runners, people on production, everybody that works around you, the makeup artists, whoever it may be, the majority of people that work around you every single day are claiming that it is a sigh they are, it's, it's a breath of relief. They're feeling relief that you've left the show, clearly showing that, you know, there were stories that Holly wouldn't speak to some of the people when the cameras were off. Same with Phil. They were quite rude in that manner. They were chauffeured everywhere, you know, treated as the main stars. And of course, people around who work day and night, long hours, probably didn't like any of that and clearly are showcasing a sight of relief that both Holly and Phil have gone and that a new set of people can return. Now, it probably is has been confirmed, but there are a lot of talks that Holly is returning to Dancing on Ice, so she has her gig there for sure. It looks like she just left primetime TV in the morning, and it looks like we're going to get two new complete presenters. Who are they going to be? I really don't know, but I'm just so confused with the fact that her entire team are happy that she's gone. Um, the team felt there were also repercussions for them as the program was thrown into the spotlight due to a string of scandals, they were saying. It's been a hell of a year. It's understandably taken a toll on the crew who have to work through some very miserable times with them. When it was announced Holly will no longer be returning, everyone working backstage breathed a huge sigh of relief. It felt like finally they can get some normality back at work, having spent such a long time at their lowest. Wow. Wow not their lowest. So clearly Holly was not popular at all. Um, you know, I thought it was just really Phil who was the main antagonist, let's just say, when it comes to everybody on the staff production and they weren't fans with him. But very clearly, it seems that Holly was also an individual who was not because they are now speaking out against her, saying that they're happy that she's gone, that they can finally move on. They've been the lowest in their years whilst working with her and that, you know, because of the association of also scandals, it makes it much more difficult. So it clearly looks like she didn't have the best of relationships with her team and they are speaking out against her character, which I'm not surprised by but I also didn't expect, and we're just gonna keep it at that. Let me know what your thoughts are when it comes to this quick three minute video. If you have not subscribed, it's just one click, guys. I give you content every single day. I would really appreciate it if you guys just subscribe to the channel. I would really, really appreciate it if you guys did subscribe. It's 24 seven content three to five videos every single day. Like who does that? Subscribe to the channel, please. And I'll catch you guys soon for another video.